I can't sleep. There's a spider scaring me in my bedroom. Okay, I'm coming. Wait, that's it? It's so tiny. Why are you worried about such a little- You know, kid, your parents keep telling you about all the money they save for your future, but really they spend it on clothing for their video game characters. You're wasting my future on virtual clothes? No, that's not true. It's mostly dance moves. Before I let you into the room, I need to make sure my dog approves of you. Oh, hey, little doggy. I've never lived with a dog before. Oh, dang it. Sorry, I'm so clumsy. I'm always dropping food. This one's a keeper. Hey, boss, I'm going to be late to work. I'm having car trouble. Oh, do we need to send someone to come get you? No, I'll figure it out, or I'll ride my bike today. Okay, see you soon. Sure, ride your bike. Or maybe call another Uber behind my back? You were giving yourself an oil change. I didn't want to bother you. The last slice of cake. I guess my birthday is officially over. No, I'll cut it in half. Eat part of it now and the other half tonight. I'll savor the anticipation, dreaming of the future where we are reunited once more. Aw, you saved me half of the last piece. You're so sweet. Do you have any questions for me? My mama taught me that if you don't have anything nice to say, then don't say anything at all. I don't... Why are you bringing this up? So you know why I'm not talking about your shirt. I didn't say anything about my shirt. Well, I can certainly see why you wouldn't. Okay, so your resume says you work well with people. I'm assuming that's a typo? It's in italics. That means it's sarcasm. Oh, look at them. I wish that was me. Your wish is my command. So, tell me some more about yourself. Are you a dog or a cat person? Why? What have you heard? I don't... Did Jason put you up to this? What? Those mice were never in my mouth. I even moved the litter box into the garage. I haven't used it in months. Hey, you've been really happy lately. Yes, I got one of those new robots to do all the tasks I hate. Oh, like doing the dishes and taking out the trash? No, I never minded those things. So what does it do? More complex things, like making doctor's appointments. Wow, that's super advanced. It even maintains friendships with people my owner finds boring. What are some of your skills? I'm really good at making mistakes. I don't see how that's helpful. Well, I make everyone else in my department look good. I don't make catastrophic decisions that cost the company lots of money. And there's something about my face that gives people a vibe of, ah, oh, they mean well. And I really like the sound of your voice. I'm told it's a natural stress reducer. Hey, Franklin, nice shirt today. Thank you, it's very comfortable. Where did you get it? Oh, uh, the store. What store, you goof? The, uh, shirt store? What shirt store? Look, I don't buy them. They just show up in my closet periodically, and my husband compliments me when I put them on. Come here. Who's a good puppy? Is it you? Yes, it's you. You're the good puppy. Okay. They don't know about the shoes. There's still time to hide the evidence. Hi, my son just came running home crying because you swore at him. Oh, goodness, I did. He told me you said, go home to your own damn house. Yes, I did say that. Well, please don't say damn in front of my child again. Oh, my mistake. Damn isn't a bad word in my house. My apologies. Humans are so peculiar. Can I borrow $50? For what? Candy? <laughs> that would be a lot of candy. That's the idea. Space Wizards the Revenge looks fun. We should go together. Wait. Are they asking me out on a date? One week later? This is probably just a friendship thing. Two years later? I now pronounce you spouses for life. I guess this is probably a thing to make our taxes easier? Eight years later? School was fun today. Hmm. I think they might be dropping me some hints. Hey, boss. I'm glad that you're finally willing to listen to the ideas of your employees. I am? Yeah. 
We got all these suggestion cards that we filled out. Oh, right. The suggestion box is right there. This is just a shredder. Is that too passive aggressive? I was originally going to just use a recycle bin. What do you think? Taylor! Hey, Lex. How's it going? Good. You? I'm fantastic. That's great. Well, see you later. You bet. Thanks for letting me stay at your place. Where's your kettle? My what? Your kettle. You know, the thing you plug into the wall to make hot water? For tea. The thing they use in old movies? Those go on the stove. I've never heard of an electric one. How do you make hot water? In the microwave. Like a normal person. You can't eat water in a microwave? The tea would taste horrible! I think you are confused as to where the flavor in a cup of tea comes from. Clown supplies. Props. Novelties. Can I help you? Yeah, can I test out one of your oversized mallets? Uh, sure thing, kid. Knock yourself out. What are some of your other skills? I improve productivity on days where there's free food. Typically, everyone will hover around the table chatting about mundane things, not wanting to seem rude. I get right in there and fill up my plate, breaking the ice and making it socially acceptable for others to start taking food. Wow, that is useful. Easily cuts 20 minutes out of the whole process. We have a tray of bagels in the meeting room that have turned to stone because nobody wanted to be first. I even have my own bagel slicer. Hi, would you like to buy some cookies to help support the gopher guides? No thanks, I already got five boxes from my manager's kid. You're making a mistake. How so? My dad is watching and we live two houses away. It's going to be awkward all summer when you are both out doing yard work and make eye contact. Alright, fair enough. Can I help you find something? Yeah, do you have any yarn that's thinner than this? Are you knitting socks? No, conspiracy theory. A what? You know, a bunch of newspaper clippings and photos all over my wall. I need some red string to connect the dots. Oh yes, we have a special section in the back for you with highlighters and thumbtacks. I knew it. Did you hear Adi got promoted? Yeah, I'm happy for her, but I'm kind of sad. She was the only one left in this department I had anything in common with. Now I'll have no one to talk to. You talk to me every day. Your desk is next to the vending machine. Talking to you is just the toll I have to pay to get snacks. Wow, you did this? It's amazing. Yes, I did. Thank you. Well, keep at it. You might even turn this into a career someday. Oh, I've been a professional artist for years now. What? Really? Yep, this is my job. This is how I pay my bills and support my family. You get paid to make this crap? What is wrong with people? Who would buy this? Love is a five-letter word. What? Because it's incomplete without you. Lavu? No. Luav? Stop it. It is 2 o'clock p.m. You should begin the day's activities. I'm too sad to get up today. I will carry you to the nutrition station. You're too small. I'm too heavy for you to lift. Artificial gravity... Disabled. What's funny about this meme you sent me? The dog with the missing boot? Yeah, I don't get it. It's a reference to that other meme with the goat that steals boots. Well, you have to remember the meme about the goat farm and cross-reference it with the old McDonald's commercials and that one episode of Spongebob where Patrick asks if mayonnaise is an instrument. Why are you like this? Why are you like that? I'm the normal one here. Well, what do we have here? Let's check our scanner. Bzz, beep, beep, boop. Oh, I see. Hmm. This does not look good at all. According to these scans, your snuggle reserves are dangerously low. <sighs> For my first wish, I would like some ice cream. Easy. Ah! Ah, dang. I need another slice of cake. What? No. You don't get two desserts. But I was looking at my phone. So? I don't even remember eating the first one. 
It doesn't count. Welcome to Apple Garden. Have you been here before? No, it's our first time. Okay, what you're going to do is pick a food from this list, and then some people in the back will cook it for you. I'll then bring the food out here to the table for you to eat. Oh, I get it. Cool. You may think that I forgot, that I never got revenge, but I'm the one that snuck into your office break room and microwaved the fish. Well, I admit that going to the laundromat was a weird choice for a first date, but I had fun. Let me just put these clothes away and we can go to lunch. Where did you get that dresser? I built it myself. Will you marry me? Can we at least get a sandwich first? Hey, nice wheelbarrow. Barrow. What? It's a wheelbarrow, not a barrel. Actually, it says here the first ones were barrels cut in half with a wheel added to it. You just made that up. No, I didn't. You're just tapping your hand. You don't even have a phone. Is your refrigerator running? Yes. Well, you better go catch it. Oh yeah, it's on the news right now. Dang, my leftover pizza is still in there. You're putting ketchup on eggs? Yes. Gross, that looks horrible. Uh, thanks? You're actually going to eat it? What did you think was going to happen? But I said it looks horrible! Okay, so maybe don't eat any of my food? I have to take a package to the post office tomorrow, but I have an irrational fear that the giant glass door will shatter when I open it. Has that ever happened before? No. Then don't worry, it's going to be fine. That's not how irrational fears work. So, what do you think is wrong with me? Let me enter your symptoms into the system. Oh, oh, I see. Hmm. What is it? Well, it seems the problem is that you are human. Oh, no. You just kind of wear out over time. Is this the new Space Wizards game? Yes, check out the character I'm making. You've been in here for like five hours. Yeah, so? Have you even played the actual game yet? Leave me alone, I like this part. Nice meeting you here. We should... Wait, hold on. I'll be right back. Fancy meeting you here. Hey, do you have a minute? Sure, what's up? My machine has been acting weird all day, and now the screen's gone all fuzzy. Did you try clicking the mouse like a thousand times? Of course, that's like the first thing I tried. Well, I'm out of ideas. You better call tentacle support. Hello, this is Jason. How can I help? This is my favorite flavor. Do you want to try it? Sure. Well, I'm glad you like it. Hey, how's it going? I haven't seen you in forever. Okay, wait. Are they a handshaker or a hugger? Better play it safe and just go for the shake. No, I think they're going for a hug. Yes, I see the signs of a hug. Activate emergency hug mode. Arms out, arms out. Blah. Here's your ibuprofen. For what? For your headache. I said head snake. Oh, you need aspirin for that. Let's order pizza. I have a coupon here for up to $10 off for more. What does that even mean? The coupon? It means we'll save up to $10 or more on the pizza than if we didn't use the coupon. But what do we actually get? The coupon promises all possible numbers. It's not all numbers. It's just up to $10 or more. But up to $10 is a number between 0 and 10. Or more is a number between 10 and infinity. What do we actually get? Do you want pizza or not? I want food free from existential math questions. Your enlargement gun, can I try it? No, we had to permanently disable it. Oh, why? It's just not precise enough. Like on living tissue, you could never enlarge just a dog's tail. It would change the whole dog. Hey, sweetie, I'm going to go take a walk. Okay, dear. Whoops, you have a typo. There's no you in 40. What? Don't be silly. It's from the number 4. Here, look. Just Google the number and... 40. F-O-R-T-Y. This is the correct spelling, 
in American and British English. My whole life is a lie. Let's get working on that big project that's due in two weeks. Two weeks, so not today? No, not today, but there's lots of research you have to do to get it done. I see. So if we get started today, we won't have to get all stressed and cram all that work into the last six hours. Right. I hate when we leave things to the last minute. Yes. Hey. Hey! Hmm? Aren't we gonna get working? Oh, I'm sorry. I stopped paying attention when you said, not today. And up next, we have a local farmer that has cultivated the world's largest pineapple. What inspired you to do this? Well, it's a lifelong dream come true. Now a single slice is the perfect size for making pineapple pizza. You're late. Sorry, I saw a cute dog by the bridge. Am I not cute enough to be on time? Here, I took some pictures. Move, you idiot! He might still be there! Are you ready for lunch? Yeah, I'm gonna get some of that... Chewy drink? Boba tea? No, I forget the name. It's in a bowl with a spoon. Soup? Did you... Did you actually forget the word soup? Look, I'm very busy. I don't have time for all your word rememberings. Boss battle! Armor upgrade! Weapons maxed! Look, you just need to submit your vacation request two weeks in advance. Dang it! I spilled orange juice again because you never tighten the lid. Never? You're exaggerating. No, I'm not! You do it on everything! Peanut butter, aspirin, pickles! If there's a screw on lid, you just gently place it on top. So, your observation is that every time I use a container with the top that needs to be screwed on, I don't do it? Always? Without fail? Yes! It sounds like the real issue is you have a problem with recklessly shaking containers without checking the lid. Check out this cute video. Ah, adorable. Let me see if I have any good ones for you. Wait! You've already seen my video! You have it saved right there! I've seen it before, but this is different. Now, I've seen it with you. During a visit to an experimental research facility, I was bitten by a radioactive lack of imagination and became super boring. You seem exhausted. Well, I had that dentist appointment today. Oh, right. What else did you do? Just the dentist. You're exhausted from one appointment? Yes. All morning was stress and anxiety worrying about the appointment and afterwards was filled with stress and anxiety over how I wasted the whole day worrying about the appointment and how can I possibly make up for all that lost time? How do you ever get anything done? Exactly! Tap here to use your phone camera to try on your new glasses virtually. Whoa, technology is amazing. Uh... What? That can't be right. What's wrong? Oh, it's nothing. You can't say that and not tell me. It's just that I typed the word renaissance and spell check didn't have to correct it. Are you sure? Go back and misspell it on purpose. I did! And it changed it back to my original spelling. This is impossible. You're scaring me! Why is a fly called a fly? Hmm, that's a good question. I guess back when they were inventing words, it was the most famous flying thing around. Oh wow, you're getting a lot of work done today. Yeah, but I'm procrastinating working. You're what? I'm procrastinating on the work I need to do by doing other work I want to do. Does that help? Not really. I'm exhausted from working all day while stressed out by the looming deadline of the thing I'm ignoring. Hmm, I should go finish my spreadsheets. Do you want help with them? I'm gonna say something. Sweetie, just ignore it. It's gonna ruin my whole night. I can't just sit here. Uh, excuse me, your right ear is inside out? Oh, thank you. Hmm. Hey, it's that sketchbook I bought you last year. Wait, it's still blank? Yes, of course. Don't you like it? Yeah, 
I love thinking about all the wonderful things I could draw in it. So draw them. No, don't you see? This empty book has so much potential. The things I think about drawing are so much better than anything I might actually draw. What about the pen I got you? Oh, I can never keep track of pens for more than three days. Oh no, I accidentally stole this box of cereal from the store. <laughs> what? How do you accidentally steal something? I was using the self-checkout and there was a problem scanning the bananas and I had to get help and in the confusion I never scanned the cereal. I just left it in the cart. What do I do? I didn't mean to steal it. Don't worry about it. I'm sure it happens all the time. Maybe next week I should get another box and scan it twice? Just think of it as payment for being the cashier they no longer employ. Good night, puppers. See you in the morning. Hey, how's it going? Well, so far today I lost my good pen and then I spilled coffee on my left shoe. What? You're supposed to just say good, how are you, and I say good, and we go on with our days. But what if I'm not good? I don't need to know about it. Then maybe don't ask. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Eating ice cream? Don't do it like that. Eat it out of a bowl like a civilized human. Do you think we should order pizza? Hmm? Sorry, I was rumbling my ears and couldn't hear you. You were what? Ear rumbling. You know, that sound you make in your ears? It's like distant thunder. You're imagining thunder? No, you flex a muscle inside your ears and it makes a sound. I do it when I'm bored. I'm trying to decide whether I should be impressed or offended. Let's just order a pizza or something. I'm starving. Wait, when did they put in that new building on the corner? Hmm? That's always been there. I've... I've never seen it before. Are you sure? Yeah, that was here when we moved to town eight years ago. I feel like I'm being pranked. That would be a pretty elaborate prank. What if this is a glitch in the simulation we all live in? Then I would have to be part of the simulation. Look at them. Why can't I have that? I know. I'll download one of those apps. Dang it, this spreadsheet is all messed up. More like dreadsheet. I dread having to use them. I gotta get this fixed before the meeting. I'd like to fix that meeting by not being there. Why does everything have to be so complicated? It doesn't have to be. The boss just wants you to feel like you're earning your salary. Are you just going to stand there and make jokes? Of course. That's my deal. Laura is the helpful one. Hello. What book are you reading? Pistols and Petals. It's about a black market arms dealer trying to start a flower shop and lead a normal life. An arms dealer? Like weapons? Guns? Yeah. Like an armed guard? Armed and dangerous? Right. Oh. Oh my gosh. What? You know, when people flex their biceps and say, Look at these guns. That's... That's what they're talking about. It's a pun. Guns are sometimes called arms, so they're calling their arms guns. Yes, I know. You knew? Yeah. Everybody knows. It's an obvious joke. Well, not everybody. Why did you think people were doing that? I don't know. Maybe they were pretending to be cyborgs? Cyborgs? That's silly. Don't insult my heritage. My love, you are my world. My everything. My life was empty before we met. I would die for you. Did you take the garbage out yet? I would die for you. Wow, that was a cool TV show. What did you think? Let's watch episode two right now. No, this is regular TV. We have to wait a week before the next episode is on. That's not how it works. Just hit play. No, I'm serious. We have to wait a week. A week? Who can plan that far into the future? I might even like this show by then. I could be a completely different person. Sorry. Sometimes that's just how it goes. Whoever came up with this idea is going to get fired. There's no way this is going to catch on. Life is bright and beautiful. It's amazing and full of potential. 
for the first few minutes after the caffeine hits. Sorry I was a little late. Those elevators have so many buttons. <laughs> no problem. Congrats on winning the design contract. There were a lot of good candidates. Thanks, it's great to be working with you. When do you need this by? We need it by the 18th at the absolute latest. Okay, I'll set an alarm for 5 a.m. on the 18th. Oh, you can just email the file. You don't need to get up early to come here. Oh, I won't even start this project until 2 a.m. on the day it's due. This alarm is so I know when to start panicking. I love bedtime. Some quiet time for myself. I get to relax and recharge. Contemplate all of my life's mistakes simultaneously. Pillows. You can lead a horse to water, but you can't make it drink. You can lead a horse to Walter, but Walter doesn't like horses. Now you've made him upset. Good job. You can lead a horse to flowers, perhaps for something to eat. Those were Walter's flowers. What is your deal? Leave him alone already. What did he ever do to you? Why are you so obsessed with horses anyway? You own three cars. Wait, don't look yet. Okay. Now. <gasps> the floor is lava. I got that promotion at work. So now we can afford some nicer things. It's so luxurious. The humans are at work. Select option one, sniff floor. Option two, look out window. Option three, jump on couch. You have selected jump on couch. This is so exciting. Doctor, I've been having trouble lately with minor injuries. Such as? I'll jam my finger trying to get something out of a drawer, and now it's like my finger just hurts for the rest of my life? Yes, that sounds right. What do you mean? You're getting older. This is just what happens. But I'm only 35! How are there people in their 70s? Now you understand why they are so grumpy. But I'm already the grumpiest person I know. Don't worry, you'll unlock a new level of grumpiness after we get these test results. One, One hour, hour left. left. Our, Our biggest, biggest sale, sale of the year. year. Don't, Don't miss out. out. You won't, you won't see, see savings, savings like this again. again. Oh, heck yes. I've been waiting on this for weeks. Posted 12 hours ago. Monday. Stay up late thinking about stuff. Tuesday. Stay up later thinking about how you stayed up late thinking about stuff. Wednesday. Stay up even later, thinking about how thinking about staying up late is causing you to stay up late. Thursday. Start drawing a comic about how you are staying up even later than before by thinking about how you have been staying up late from thinking about how staying up late is causing you to stay up way too late. I'm tired of that cereal. Let's try the new stuff. No, you have to finish this one before you open the new box or Dad gets mad. What does he care? He doesn't even eat cereal. I don't know, something about learning responsibility and there's consequences for your choices. Well, he's right. You chose this first box, so the responsible thing to do is finish what you started. And it's important to listen to your dad. But I am also your dad, and I get to teach you how to break the rules without being caught. Like opening the new cereal from the bottom of the box. <gasps> it's late, dear. Come to bed. Hold on, I'm almost done. What are you doing? Just altering some of our kids' baby photos. Why? Well, I've noticed they've been snooping around the network, trying to get into my files. I want to give them something exciting to uncover. You're making it look like our children are robots that we built. <laughs> yes. They're at the perfect age where this will seem impossible, but suddenly make all the sense in the world. You're new here, so I figured I should give you a heads up about the owner of the company. All right. He comes by this time every week and likes to pretend he's the boss by telling everyone to do the things that they're already doing. <laughs> okay, then. Hey, Steve! Make sure you show the new guy how things work around here and make him feel welcome. Sure thing, boss. New guy, I want you to have an existential crisis thinking about all the decisions in your life that led you to this point 
instead of becoming a musician like you always dreamed. I can't sleep because of the monster under my bed. Ah, this again. Hey, it's late. Either shut off your game or put on headphones. Oh, dang, sorry about that. Good night, sweetie. Good night. We may not always see eye to eye, but I will always be there for you. We may have our differences, but together we are stronger. Let's just order two pizzas so I can have pepperoni and you can indulge your weird pineapple fetish or whatever nonsense you're on about this week. Be gone, foul demon! <laughs> what a pitiful guard for such an amazing treasure. Finally, the sacred amulet is mine! Now I will have the power to... Wait, it's a trap! My body is disintegrating! I'm such a fool! I have one last chance. I can use my remaining power to cast myself back in time and stop myself from entering this room! Be gone, foul demon! I'm gonna grab a midnight snack. It's only 10 p.m. Okay, I'll grab a 10 p.m. snack. You can't do that. That's not a thing. I'll grab a snack that's not attached to any specific time of day. Bring me cookies! Please sign this Get Well card for Gwen. Yes, of course. Flowers and a card arrived from your friends at work. Dear Jen, I don't know who you are, but my boss is watching me do this, so I'm making it look sincere. Good news! Our problems are solved! You got a job? No, I installed a second toilet paper holder. A sec... what? We no longer have to get in fights about this. We will always have one roll the correct way and one for you. Subscribe. And check out more of my animations down here.